Kyle basically already gave it all away. Uh, MSP Geek has always been about uh, helping each other, helping everybody, coming coming together as a community. Uh, and like I myself started off as someone who doesn't know what they were doing. Uh, you know, I did. I, I was a break fix person. Something was broken. I could figure out how to fix it. But ask me how to automate or a script or whatever. And I'd be like, I don't know. That's dev stuff. Leave me alone. To this day, I say I'm not a developer. Totally a developer. Um, which I'm not in any way, shape or form. Um, and then I joined Lab Tech Geek at the time, uh, now MSP Geek. And the amount of like the force multiplier I received from the amount of feedback I got, the pushing I, I got from the community to like, try this, try that, learn this. And like they gave, you know, half answers to push me to do more has significantly pushed my knowledge and skills to the point where you know, I would consider myself to be DevOps, not developer. <laughs> I don't write anything from scratch, not full stack at all, but I can definitely automate and script things uh, if I need to. Um, so, you know, one of the things that we wanted to give back in the conference was one of the pain points that we saw in the community a lot. Like people would come in, there was this lack of fundamentals that exists. There are a lack of fundamentals that exist within organizations. We don't have a, a you know a standard across all tier ones. This is all this is what all tier ones should know. This is what all tier two should know. And one of the problems that we have across the system, whether it's with us working with outside support or whether it's us trying to find a talent to fill in gaps within our industry, or whether it's us trying to find a new place, is that people come in and go, "Hey, I'm in tier two tech." And they're not actually really a tier two tech. They they were just called a tier two tech at their last job, or you know, tier two meant something else to them than what it means to you. So, in reality, the way it works is that people who have achieved, and I'm not going to say tier or anything, but who have achieved the ability to sit down and figure out any kind of issue, like if they if they are the highest level escalation within the organization and they don't call anybody else or they'll sit down and they'll work through the problem and they'll get it fixed, they tap into skills that are not easily identifiable, they're not easily quantifiable. And those are the skills that we want to teach. We're not teaching, you know, like Kyle said, we're not teaching how to open reg regedit or how to, you know, use process monitor or procmon or anything like that. We're not teaching tools. We're not teaching knowledge of, or content of how to use tools. We're teaching problem solving skills. And that is the core of this conference for year one that we want to try to accomplish. We're looking for our goal is that a tier one technician can come to the conference and walk out two days later, having the same skills and abilities as a tier three person. They may not have the same experience to do it as quickly, but they'll know what to do and they'll be able to accomplish it. And the more they do it, the better they'll get at it, which will bring them into that tier three level. I think one of the core things um, that's important is the the core sessions that we're highlighting and, and talking about in this specific instance has been curated. This isn't something that says, hey, uh, do you want to talk at MSP GeekCon? We have went out to individual speakers and say, we're looking for someone on this topic. We're looking to talk about these things in this topic and to have it flow in to the things before and after it and these we have approached all of our uh speakers um we've announced two of them uh aaron shernan and uh kelvin Tuckalar. uh and we we we've approached those because we feel they're experts in what we want them to talk about and they understand that that's the core focus okay um, so the like to give you an idea of what kyle's talking about in terms of curated like we sat down and First, to start off with me, and I wrote it up, and then I went to like fifteen or twenty other people, and I like got feedback, and I tweaked, and I tweaked, and I tweaked, and I, so we came up with this thing that we're calling the technical journey. And like I said, I mean, our goal is for a tier one to come in and walk out as tier three, but that doesn't mean we're not targeting tier two, tier three. Like the the things that we're doing, we're talking about tier two and tier three technicians are already doing them to a level instinctively. And what we're hoping to accomplish is to make them aware of what they're doing so they can do it better and faster and more on demand.
MSP GeekCon, a conference for MSPs by MSPs, coming May 21st through the 23rd, 2023, in sunny Orlando, Florida. Visit MSPGeekCon.com to find out more and buy your tickets now.